Right now, there actually is. It's been a lot of money actually coming in on Max Holloway here. The number has tightened. You've got Justin Gaethje around minus 165 on the comeback, plus 140 for Max. This is for the BMF title. We're going to have five rounds. Justin Gaethje, big power, those leg kicks we all know about. And then Max Holloway on the other side, just fantastic pressure and also volume and high-level striking. Now, this is the second time that Max Holloway has moved up to 155 pounds. Last time that he did that was back in uh, 2019, actually, I think it was, where he fought Dustin Poirier. Now, this was just a bad showing for him where you kind of saw the power difference was massive. Now, I know that everyone's going to be talking about this fight as a fight of reference. Um, some people think it's too much to be said because it was years ago and all those things. But for me, it was just such a power difference, even though Max landed uh, 181 strikes to 178 strikes. It was just the damage was different. The power was different. How Max was absorbing shots was different. While Ga while Poirier could kind of walk through those punches, he dropped Max. He rocked him multiple times. It was just kind of, you know, it was a 49-46 decision, and rightfully so, but that's kind of how I see this fight kind of going here because you've got uh, Gaethje, who is going to probably have more power than uh, Dustin Poirier. He's a big 155-er, and that's the other part of this is that Max is trying to gain the weight and gain the size and muscle to kind of fit yeah. into this division. And that's been his thing. He's kind of a tweener. He kind of, you know, a little bit big for the 145, a little too small for 155. And that's kind of how this could go. But you also look at it is, does this added weight at this point in his life, does it kind of take away the things that made Max great? You know, his movement, his, his um, you know, uh, really just the output that he has. Is it going to make him slower? Will he have the cardio? All those things start to make a little bit of like, could make you worried, which, I again, I agree why uh, Gaethje is the favorite here. And then also you look at it, it's just the damage. I think he's going to land big damage here, Gaethje. I think he's going to land the bigger shots, the more powerful shots. And also, you know, he's still got that power. Justin Poirier is a guy who's only been knocked out three times in his professional career. Justin Gaethje just did that recently. Before that, it was um, Michael Johnson in 2016, uh, uh, was it McGregor in 2014? I mean, these are way far back. I think this is a spot where Gaethje gets that knockout, hammers on those front legs. I like him. He's plus 155. Gaethje be a knockout. I think that's the side, and, and I agree with the press. I think he gets the job done.